Hi, this is Richard Byrne at freetechforteachers.com. In this video, we're going to take a look at Duolingo for Schools, which is a free service designed to help you help your students learn a new language. Let's go ahead and get started here. And I'm going to go and log into my account. Now I'm here in my account. Let's go ahead and create a new classroom. And this one we'll just call it um, Mr. Burns Classroom. Now you can choose the language that you are teaching. In my case, I'll pick Spanish. I'll create the classroom. And now to invite students, we have a couple of options. We can click invite students and send them this link here. Copy the link, just give them that link. Or if you're using Google Classroom, you can share your link in your Google Classroom. In this case, I'm just going to copy that link. And let's take a look at how the student onboarding process will look. So the student will put that link into his or her web browser. And they're going to learn Spanish. And in this case, we'll sign up Morrison. And we'll give Morrison a password. And the student will get this little reminder that their teacher is able to track their progress. Right. And now the students can go through this little tour here. Right. And if they hover over the words, they see the translations. They'll be given a little practice exercise. And there's even a little virtual keyboard to help them out. They're going to be asked to connect their Facebook account, and we'll just say skip that. They can choose what type of player they're going to be. And now they hit, now they are here on the home page. And they can take a test or just review the basics here. And if we go back to my teacher panel, and we go back into my classroom, we'll see I now have a student named Morrison, and click on his name. And we can see the kind of progress he's made. In this case, he hasn't made any progress. He has simply signed up for the service. And you can invite more students if you like. So that's how you can get started with Duolingo for Schools. It's a free service. And for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com.